and welcome back to Song Reaction Analysis with your girl, JVB. How are you guys doing today? First and foremost, thank you so much for being here on my channel, checking out my reactions as well as my own music. And in the description below, you can find out all the links in case you don't know who I am. In case you don't know who I am yet, I'm a singer, songwriter, music producer, and composer, vocal performance coach, and I love doing reaction videos for you guys. If you haven't yet, make sure that you hit the subscribe button, the like button, and the notification bell so you never miss a post of mine. Definitely the like button. Just do it right this second, right now. Dimas, set a party. We are doing another reaction for non blondes. What's up? That is such an epic, legendary song by Linda Perry. We have to check it out. And I mean, I already know Dimas is so freaking talented, so I'm not even doubting that he can't do it. But I'm super stoked and excited how he's going to do it because he is one of my favorites on this channel. With no further ado, let's get straight into it. Oh, yes, we love Dimas Senopati. And I love saying his name. It rolls off the tongue so easily. Um, yes, here we go. Twenty five years in life, we still trying to get out that. Quickly went the I shoot that the world was made up of this brotherhood of men for whatever that means. And so I cry sometimes when I'm lying in bed, just get it all out what's in my head, and I, I'm feeling a little peculiar. I just love his voice so much. <laughs> so I love how he always finds a way to like, he sings clean and then he sings a little bit raspy. I love how he like switches back and forth. It makes it so interesting. I love that. And it ex accentuates the words. Um, and I love the guitar player. He's so chill and just like so cool. Just standing there. He reminds me of like a Indonesian version of Slash. <laughs> you know? All right. Let's back, like, back up a little bit to here. When I'm lying in bed, just get it all out. What's in my head? And I'm, ah, I'm feeling it. a little <laughs> peculiar. And so I wake in the morning and it's the bow time. And I take a deep breath and I get I love that he's so much in his mask, right? He's singing like right here. And then at the same time, he has that nice rasp in the back, which sounds so good and so holistic, you know? It's it's like really, nothing sounds forced. It comes out so easily. And he has such a nice high voice. It comes so effortlessly. It makes it just so, oh, so pleasure. It's such a pleasure to listen to that. I say, ah, yeah, yeah. Ah, so 
again. I try all the time in this institution, and I pray. I might go to pray. I pray a single day for revolution. Ah. Oh. I hope Linda Perry heard this because he is doing the song so much justice. Ah, I love when he how he has the ability to just be so raspy and dirty sounding up there, but it's clean, you know what I mean? There's no no straining going on, nothing going on. It's just so effortless. Ah, he's such an amazing singer. Oh. And I pray. Oh my God, do I pray? I pray a single day for revolution. And so I cry sometimes when I'm lying bed, just get it all out what's in my head, and I. Sometimes I can't shut my mouth. Okay, let's go back to here a little bit. It's just so good. And it's such a good freaking song. Great song choice. Ah! Hide and die, take a deep breath, and I can't will hide and die. Scream from the top of my lungs, what's going on? And I say, thing he just does that you know what I mean come on he is just so good and I have to say uh, Linda Perry is an amazing songwriter and she deserves a lot of credit for non blondes um, she's an amazing producer um, I'm not even sure why I'm plugging her right now <laughs> everybody knows her right she's amazing she's world famous she's done she's she's written beautiful for Christina Aguilera she did also let's get the party started for pink um, she had her studio not too far from where I was living in North Hollywood um, it she's an amazing person and she's done a lot of she's talented as hell and um, a great singer but then she really became a really amazing even better producer um, but she's still doing all that stuff. But listening to Senapati, like Dimas Senapati singing this song, it just he to, he so brought me back to listening to Linda Perry, to listening to Fauna and Blondes, because he really captured that vibe, that energy, and that the soul of the song. He so captured that with the awesome guitar player and his voice. 
his interpretation. I so love that. I love an artist really take a song and they own it. And he really owned the song. He is amazing. He has an amazing voice. So yeah. Woo. Amazing. With that said, I'm going to let you guys go. Uh, if you haven't yet, make sure that you hit the subscribe button, the like button and the notification bell. So you'll never miss a post of mine. And also, if you would like to support this channel, definitely hit the like button. Definitely engage. Leave a comment below what should be the next reaction. Also, you can support me by um, 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 and you can support me by joining my Patreon. <laughs> you can also buy my music, my NFTs. And also, definitely donate if you want to. Uh, it's always an option. There's many options to support this channel to help me make more reaction videos for you guys. And I also want to grow a community of like-minded people who help one another and really build a community of like-minded individuals who just love music. And through the power of music, we can all come together. This is no better way to do that. So with that said, I'm going to let you go and I'm going to leave you with something positive as always make every day a great day and just be kind, be a nice person. Realize that when somebody is not nice or not kind or just like irritated, they might have something going on. We never know what's gone, going on in someone else's mind, head, life. So before we judge someone, we should maybe find out what's going on with them and also be a bit forgiving and understanding that some people go through hard times and they have maybe not the best ability to show um, their emotions and or to deal with their emotions. So I believe that killing them with kindness is the best way to just like deal with people in life and situations in life. With that said, I'm going to let you go and I'm going to see you in the next one. Take care.